Hello everybody, we are live. Welcome back to the stream. Today we are playing some Lost Ark and I have not touched this game since I got a new PC that can actually run it, so I'm very excited. First thing I've noticed about the loading screen though is that when the game first launched this loading screen was um, it was like some guy on a ship and it looked really cool and stuff when we were sailing and now it's whatever is going on here. Oh, which is pretty nice. I'm just going to quickly check the graphics settings because oh, all the graphics look really, really high because things are looking a little blurry on my monitor. So I thought I lowered them a bit, but I guess they're not. But yeah, we have uh, a character already existing um, from when I played the game previously. And I can't remember the last time I played this. Uh, I think my internet was dying a lot that day and I kind of just gave up because it kept making my game crash because I don't know if it's still the case with this game but if you disconnect from the internet it makes you just restart the entire game instead of trying to reconnect you which was really annoying uh, when you had a PC that would take 20 minutes to boot up the game so uh, I don't have that PC anymore so um, if the, the game crashes for whatever reason it shouldn't take three years to boot up but hopefully they got rid of that pesky issue of needing to restart the game every time it disconnects and like we'll hopefully just reconnect people normally like other games do. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. So we're playing an Anteros. Uh, I cannot remember anything I did the first time round. Um, okay, we're level 22. I can remember we did just a, quite a bit of the early game. We didn't really get to anything important except finding out that the really scaredy cat priest was a hot demon. That is, uh, that is, that is the only thing I really remember. Uh, and I think the only thing of importance that really happened, to be honest. Um, so yeah, let's let's launch our character. Uh, it's also going to take me a little bit of remembering to play the game because <laughs> I, I yeah I don't I don't really remember anything. Okay, um, changing skill tree. Um, we'll figure that out later. I can remember the, there was a uh, Makoko challenge where. Unable to participate. Oh, okay. She's item level level one thousand three hundred and forty. I don't. What is my? Uh... Oh, okay. That is way lower than what I expected. Okay, so yeah, we're just not eligible for this because we are not item level one thousand three hundred and forty. We're a hundred and something. Uh, right. Grab the revival thing. Return. Uh, oh, login event. Okay, that was that was just the fact that I'm a returning player. Again, we can grab more revival things because you guys know that I die a lot in video games. I have new mail. Cool. Uh oh, mail's up here. I forgot. Um. Oh, you guys can't actually really see the top bar very well. Let's change that a little bit. Uh, lost arc. All right, make the UI a little bit smaller. Teeny weeny bit. Okay. Ooh. There we go. I mean, you can see my like uh, background poking out a little bit, but that's probably the best way that I can do it because otherwise, like, parts of the screen will just be covered. Um, and it's fine for other games, but not not really this one because you need to be able to see the top. Uh, okay. More event reward. More event reward. Hey Mike, how's it going? How's your evening? Uh, I can't remember how to claim anything though. Uh, I think I had like a bunch of drops and stuff from just like Twitch Prime and all that, but... Also, everyone's lost arc. What is this? Oh, I don't know. Okay, I'm not gonna bother using any of this now. My inventory is nearly full, but... I know I can get rid of a bunch of this stuff when I next go to a shop. Uh... Oh, 31 obtainable items. This must be... Oh yes, this is- okay, this is all literally Prime stuff that I just didn't claim. So we're gonna claim all of that now. Let's claim everything. Hello Spess, how's it going? How's your evening? It's good time I just got home from the shops. Oh no, we're gonna hear this noise over and over. Okay. I guess it's- I don't know if I claimed everything because my inventory looks full, but- 
I can remember uh, last time I played, I was doing this dungeon and it kept disconnecting, which threw me back to the beginning because I had internet issues. And uh, I very much not have internet issues anymore, but well, uh, I may have internet issues. Well, let's let's make this a little more central so you can see it better. I know you guys can see the background, which kind of sucks a little, but in this game you need to be able to like see all corners of the of the screen, so it's a uh, it matters a little bit more. How am I doing? I'm alright. I came back from the gym, so I'm feeling very tired, but also very better. <laughs> I don't know how to... I'm not just looking at what is all of this. I know that the, the game's been updated a lot since I last played, because I think it's been out for like nearly a year now. What's this called? Wardrobe. Right uh, is this the only thing that's in the shop? Okay, just just... Oh, it's okay. It's limited edition stuff. I, I don't really like it very much though. Skin. I'm just one. Oh, this is pretty. Of course, whenever I play like any kind of MMO, I always look at the stuff in the shop that you pay for with real money that I'm not actually going to buy. <gasps> this is awesome. I love that. I like the little mask. I don't know what these little icons in the corner mean. Uh, honorable graduation skins. No, this is actually so cute. I adore this. Uh, well, that one is that one is this, but in red. Oh, another sword. Uh, I guess this is all class specific stuff. Well, I can look like a really cool assassin, but I mean, I am basically playing. I don't see what the difference between these two are. I am basically playing an assassin, like a really hot assassin. This this class reminds me of like the Dark Knight in. Uh, Black Desert, but that's because of like it's basically booby assassin. Oh, this is just the same outfit in a bunch of different colors. I mean, they still don't really have very many skins, but I guess okay, I guess they all rotate after a while. Yeah, I would have thought they would have had more permanent stuff, but yeah, I guess I guess they don't. Yeah. Oh wait, here's here's the Morris, like essentially. Well, I don't know why this isn't in the skin section, but like, yeah, oh, it just isn't. But yeah, you can. There's more stuff in here. This is cool. I quite like this. I mean, it does change my character's hair color, though. I think. Oh wait, only available for designated classes. Hold on. Oh, summoner. Okay, I'm not a summoner. Maybe that's why it wasn't in my shop. Baseball fan pants. Uh, let's go past all the baseball stuff. Oh wait, you can still... Oh wait, this is a specialist and I don't have a specialist. What? You can only get really certain things. I'm sad. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. Uh, what's this? Oh, I can only play this if I'm a hot man. Unfortunately, I'm not a hot man. Reaper Dawn skin. I, I'm not. I'm not a Reaper, but this looks cool. Oh, this guy looks cool as well. I thought he had a tail at first, but it's just a bit of fabric. I'm trying to find. I'm trying to find stuff for my class, but I guess I guess the stuff that's in skin is the only stuff that's actually available for my class. Okay, I count as just assassin. All right. I mean, I thought I was like a very specific class of assassin because I, I think like assassin branches into two things. Oh, I have 20 of these fancy like goldy thingies. So, oh, this one is... Oh, okay. Essentials. Oh, uh, wait, no, not that. All class. Oh, okay, here we go. You can, we can change it. Oh, can I not change it? I literally can't click on the drop down menu. This is pretty. It's the wrong class anyway. Oh, so I don't know what this is. Oh, they're bidding in an auction. Product inventory. Oh, okay, this is stuff I couldn't actually claim because my inventory's full. Um, demons. Let's see if we can actually find a shop so I can just get rid of useless things in my inventory. How do I use this? Oh, wait, maybe... Can I just teleport through? Oh, okay. Does this have a shop? That looks like a shop. There we go. Oh, okay, you don't actually use the teleporter thing, you just teleport from a teleporter. That is that is fair enough. Hello. 
bargain prices. Come take a look. Oh, I don't want to attack you. I just want to talk. Oh, it's G. This is the only game that I've seen that actually, like... I don't want to repair it. I just want to sell it. Oh, maybe... Okay. Maybe I can't actually sell to this guy. Oh, he's a repairer. That's why. Okay, here we go. Uh, sell. Uh, that is bad. That is bad. 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 I mean, I'm just going to get rid of, like, the less rare versions of, like, what I'm already wearing. I mean, there isn't really a lot in it between... Oh, uh, that is really low level. Um... So the durability is kind of low. I think. Uh, is that just another version of like what I'm holding? Yeah, it is. I like what I'm wearing, rather. Well, right. Uh oh. Did I not actually? Oh, I have to right click. Okay, that's fine. Uh, yeah. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. I don't know why my inventory is so full of useless things. <laughs> oh, what is this? I don't know what domination and expertise is, I can't really remember. I guess if something says that I'm... Like, I can equip better stuff, I'm just gonna keep hold of it. Okay, that is... Literally the exact same thing as what I'm wearing. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Oh, this is like normal quality stuff, we definitely want rid of that. This stuff is like really low level anyway. Why am I holding such outdated stuff? Oh, should I sell that? Uh, yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna get rid of anything that is green and blue. Is that the same thing? Oh, hold on. Oh wait, that is domination endurance. I guess I'll hold on to that because I don't. It's endurance and expertise. That is just worse. Why is it saying it's better? Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Oh, wait, I actually got an achievement for uh, <laughs> for selling things. Getting rid of junk. Okay, um, I think that's everything I want to sell. Okay, that freed up a lot- oh, that, wait, get rid of this as well. I think- yeah, that freed up a lot of space in my inventory. Uh, right, now we can finish claiming things. Right, let's just collect everything. Get the endless annoying noise over and over again. <laughs> Product received. Okay, so that's everything. Okay, what in the what in the world did I actually just claim? Uh, LED glasses selection chat. Oh, I want LED glasses. Uh, black, silver, red, blue. I kind of like the black ones. They look really cool. Let's see if we can. Oh wait, I meant to get rid of those gloves. Oh well. Um. I don't. Skins and virtues. Oh, okay. So this is where we. I is the equivalent of like glamour stuff in FF14. Oh. So we can. Where are my LED glasses? Where are they? Pet storage. Uh. Skin. Oh, there they are. Oh, there we go. I can wear like two sets of glasses. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. <laughs> yeah, it's like so out of place on my character. I love it. Um. Uh, okay, it's P for the profile. Um. What else do I even have? Basic casting. Basic design. Yeah, looks like I can't really use it yet. I'm not gonna bother using any of the crystalline shards because, like, I don't know if I'm gonna play the game enough. Oh, new animal skin. <gasps> Ooh. I don't know if I have any of these though, so. <gasps> Moo cow skin. Okay, I've got a couple of pets, but I don't know the names of any of these pets, so I don't really wanna obtain a skin in case I get one for, uh,. A character, like, a pet I don't have. Ooh. 
<gasps> cool! Okay, Rudolph mask. Wrong time of year, but... Uh, pixel glasses selection chest. Oh, obviously we're gonna have to go with the bright pink ones. Um... Okay, I think... Oh, Heartbreaker Penguin. There's Peace and Pants. What's the difference? Uh, it's just headwear. Oh, chest piece of pants or headwear. Okay, I kind of want the full outfit. Hmm. Heartbreaker Pen- What is Heartbreaker pen Penguin? Uh, oh, okay, it is just a giant penguin suit. Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> I love that. The armor in this game leaves little to the anima animation, does it? Imagination, rather. I mean, yeah, it is an MMO. It's still not even 100% modest, but like, I think Final Fantasy XIV is probably the most modest out of all of them. Or it's like, probably Black Desert is the worst, I think. No, no, Blade and Soul, actually. Blade and Soul is the worst for uh, modesty <laughs> in terms of outfits. Um, okay, I think that's all of the skin ones. Yeah. It's going over. Yeah, okay. Um, okay, so we can either look like a really cool assassin or we can look like a penguin. Tell me, chat, which one is better? What's in here? Oh, that's okay. That's the headwear. Penguin. Okay. We will. We will look like the penguin. All right. Okay. Let's uh, speak with Armin. Cut the food around a carriage. I didn't. I remember. I didn't finish the dungeon though. So, and this was like the entrance to it. So. Reinforcements. Stop rushing. Oh wait. Where is Armin? Oh, I was all the way up there. Okay. Well, I don't really know why I need to do this dungeon, but like I haven't done it, so I'm gonna do it. What's the? Ooh. Can I enter the harder version? Demons started appearing in Sapira Cave. Who's summoning these accursed demons in the desert? Fair players, one of four people. We don't need to bother with matchmaking. We'll we'll do it ourselves. Ooh, art exclusive skins. Okay. All right. I don't know what my character does, so I'm gonna press random buttons. Oh wait, how do I dodge? Ugh. Oh, I guess. Okay. I don't know if there is a specific like dodge button, but I'm literally pressing random buttons. This seems to be working. Whatever I'm doing. I'm also trying to get used to like using like right click to move instead of WASD. Right. Where's the Oh hello. Oh I chopped my charge at that. Alright, we need to destroy the How am I destroying? Is it this goo? Yeah. Nope. Is it this thing? Oh wait, no. It's over here. What, what am I looking to destroy? There's nothing here. Oh, okay. I already destroyed it. That's why. <laughs> oh. I remember this class, this, uh, class looking really cool though. Oh, there's still- there's some dude shooting at me. There we Don't we all have a penguin that just attacks people? Eat this clump. Hot. Oh. oh, that looks cool. I also do need to keep an eye on my health because I'm taking a lot of damage. Oh. Right. 
right, okay, I think the last one's up here. Hello! Penguin violence, yes. We support angry pen penguins killing things. I should probably heal. Oh, okay, I have a lot of potions, so... All right, destroy plague orbs and stop them from spreading plague. Stinky plague. Oh, I just attacked nothing. <laughs> I have to do it with a normal attack, okay. I thought they were enemies. Oh, oh there's the enemies. Smelly plague, yeah, we don't like plague. That's a lot of enemies. Uh, I guess I just need to keep going forward. We have stopped plague, guys. We have solved illness. Worm fist. So that doesn't sound good. Oh, I need to get my gear repaired. Soul of Zorba sounds so edgy. There you go. Oh, there's a Makaka fruit over here. Nice. COVID finished. Yes, that's how we solve COVID. An angry penguin fight, like fighting and killing things. Makoko fruit from the Makoko tree. Mm, tasty giant mucus clump. There we go. Makoko fruit from the Makoko tree. How do I pick this one? Maybe I've already grabbed it. It's got like a little thing around it and won't let me pick it up, so I guess I've already grabbed it. Huh. Alright. I'm gonna assume that like... Oh. I'm gonna assume that I already picked it up. I don't know if the little circle around it means I already have, but it's not giving me the option to pick it up, so... Okay, onwards guys, through the through the sludge. Huh. Oh nice, now I'm a surfing angry penguin. I'm literally just button mashing, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm gonna be working though. Oh, 
Oh, I don't know what that was aimed at. <laughs> what are you aiming at? Oh, that's a big boy. Oh, that's what that does. Okay. friends. I mean, I'm assuming this game is supposed to be like constant shredding things. Maybe I'm just slightly over leveled, I don't know. I could be slightly over leveled. How's my day been? Yeah, it's been alright, just very tiring. I had to pay attention to things for five hours straight, which I, I kind of normally like struggle with. How about you guys? How's your day been? Is this boss time? I also used up my super powerful awesome move of mega death like before hitting the boss because I didn't know what it did. There's one angry sludge. Hello. Oh wait, oh, I can't I can't use my super mega thing of mega death. Counts my blade dance. Okay, we're shutting his health pretty quickly though. That was a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Okay, we got him. Nice. That is big, big stinky boss dead. Deaded. Uh. Oh dear, what was it? Uh, just a lot of events at work. Um, you do need to kind of pay attention at work, which... Um... Yeah, paying attention is not really my fault, though. <laughs> so I'm glad, I'm glad you, uh... You had a good day, Mike. Yeah, maybe, maybe I'm a little over leveled for this area because I didn't particularly find this boss hard, despite despite doing the hard version of the dungeon. Like I barely lost any health as well. Oh, wrong button. I keep using right click instead of left click. Nice but full health. Where do you think you're going? Hello. Oath of Bandits? Oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, what is even up here? Yeah. 
wounded heart chest face. Hello. Oh, skills on cooldown. Oop. I just took a bunch of damage when I was on. Oh, jeez, my health. Okay. That's okay. I oh, know I'll be alright. Nice. Okay, he's dead. <gasps> McGoggle fruit. Okay, that's what one that I haven't uh, gathered actually looks like. This is quite easy because you haven't played in months. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Like, shouldn't that make it a bit harder if I don't really know what I'm doing? Okay, uh, what's my durability? Oh, okay. It is literally about to run out. We're gonna have to go repair gear after this dungeon. Is it possible to sprint in this game? I don't actually know. Uh, this is okay. This is all just consumables. I hope you guys like Pedro following on behind me. I can remember like before in games, like when I didn't know what to name things, I would just name them Pedro because why not? <laughs> Activate. I shall. I see a big lever, therefore I shall pull it. Uh, did I go that way? Oh, that's the way back to the beginning. Hello! Stinky demons. Alright. Is there actually anything down here? Oh, there's another lever! Oh, there's a big boss over there. Okay, let's heal before doing that. Hello! Okay. Big boss. Hello. Oh. Oh, that was easy. Oh shoot, I'm stuck. Oh, there we go. I guess the thing that's supposed to make this boss hard is that there's a lot of enemies. Hello. Vote for Pedro. I happily vote for Pedro. Hello, King Pinky. How are you? Right. Okay, I need to destroy the evil circle of evil death. It sounds more impressive if you say evil twice. And it sounds even more impressive if you say evil three times, like, uh, evil circle of evil magic of evil death. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this either. Alright, I think that's all enemies dead, actually. Nice! Okay, let's continue onwards. There's some more angry demons. It's so satisfying hitting like seven of these guys at once with that one move. With this, uh, pole star. But what about evil demons of evil circles of evil magic of evil death? That's, that's four evils. Another boss? Or is that just a big enemy? Oh, it's just, oh, it's just a big enemy. Oh, oh I walked into that. Oh, oh. Okay. 
Okay, what's in here? Oh, okay, this is the big boss. Okay. Oh, oof. Oh, dear. Okay, that's a lot of damage. Ow. Oh, I can't move. Oh. Okay, I actually have to... Oh, ow. Gee, okay, this guy... This guy does damage. Okay. Oh, no, I can't move! Okay. Oh, there's a dash. I didn't actually know there's a dash. Okay. This guy is actually quite tough. No, we'll just wait to recover health. Pack him in the back. Ugh. Oh, I can't actually grab him. Ugh. No, no! Oh, no! Okay, there we go. Okay, stop this attack. Okay, the plague, the plague struck is pain. Oh jeez, ow. Okay. Time to keep running away from him until this this CC attack is done. Uh, not CC, the uh, damage over time effect is done. There we go. Okay, there we go, now I can attack him again. Oh, I'm done, I walked into that. Okay, we nearly got him. Oh. Yeah, it's called CC in other games though, Mike. But that wasn't CC, it was damage over time. <laughs> I just got the words wrong. Okay, we'll just stand over here while we wait for that attack to end. Okay. We've nearly got him. Okay. Oh, dear, I'm stuck. Um, okay, now I'm actually CC'd. Oh. Got him. Nice. The penguin has done it, guys. Hello, I just woke up from hibernation. That's <laughs> almost what I'm preparing for my next hibernation. Hello, Opalvex, how are you? How is your hibernation? Oh, it's the hot demon. That's the only thing I remember about this game. I beg you, Master Carmine. Just give me one more chance. It's fine. I completely understand. Oh, he's a nice demon. But you should rest up. Maybe take a break. A long, permanent. Oh, he's not us. Need a much more powerful soul. Oh, off he goes again. I love how much my character swings her hips in a giant penguin outfit. <laughs> okay, uh, was there anything like on the platform next to the boss? I didn't actually really check. Like anything up here? Wow, I can't even break the pots. Breaking pots is like one of my favorite things in video games. I have an Asian last 11.7 months in total. It's truly a, a sad existence. Wait, can I not go this way? Do I like... How do I leave? I can't go that way. Huh? Do I have to go back to the beginning? I guess so. Because it looks like I should be able to walk this way, but... Hmm. So 
Favor card deck. I don't know what card decks are, but... Oh, combat skills. I should probably... Oh, I have... Okay, I got one skill point, but... Um... How much of these do I actually use? Swift fingers. Oh, wait, no. Okay, that's just the death sentence. Uh, okay, it's one... To level up. Sure, we'll use we'll level up that. Skill tree. Oh. Eighteen out of eighteen. So what is that for? Um. Okay, I don't know what eighteen out of eighteen skill tree level activation means. I mean, maybe this number just gets higher, but I have absolutely no idea. So we'll figure it out. Oh, it's fun, but I need to go say goodbye to my family and friends. Bye. Bye, Opal Vex. Have a wonderful day. And I'll, I'll see you when you next wake up from hibernation. Okay, do I really need to go back to the beginning? I don't... Surely it, like, teleports you or something instead of, like, making you walk all the way back to the beginning. <laughs> right? Oath of Bandits. I don't know what this is. Oh. Okay, it's just law. Cool. Awesome. Okay. I might just be being dumb, though. Collectibles. Oh, it's just Makoko seeds. Yay! We've collected 1% of the world's Makoko seeds, guys. This is your character gonna get that cardio in. I already did cardio though. Uh, I mean, I guess it's not a very big map and we can get back very quickly, but. Yeah, I guess, I guess this wasn't really the main story, but event quest. So, oh, okay. We we literally yeah, we we can't do it because because I uh, I'm baby and uh, that that event is not for babies. Oh, we can still fight things. Oh. I did not mean to press two. Oh, what does this even do? Oh, it's, oh, okay. It's increased move speed. Okay, that's actually really useful. Okay. Oh, and I already used it. Fuck. It's only 12 seconds! Okay. Um, that's shield. That's damage. And... Left the mark of wagon. Party move speed. Okay, well, I guess we'll just use this. Um, try forward. This way. <gasps> Hello, Frostbringer! How is it going? How is your evening? I wonder if I can also just use my dash to move faster. Oh. oh, right, okay, we need to go this way. I don't know if it's normal in this game to have to run all the way back to the beginning or if I just couldn't go through the door for whatever reason, but we're going this way now. Oh no! No! Not that! See, I've heard that so many times, but I can't remember whether- Oh wait, we can't go back this way. How do I- Wait, how do I leave? Because we can't go back this way. How do I leave? I'm like actually kind of stuck, guys. I don't actually know how to leave. I think I'm just being dumb. Okay. Let's let's go all the way back because I, I can't walk to the entrance. Yada yada, does it? Oh yeah, it's from JoJo. I've never actually seen JoJo, but I really love the art style. What um what season are you on then, uh, Frostbringer? Right, which way am I going? 
Why won't it let me leave? Oh, did I? Oh, this is a shortcut. Oh, my cocoa tree. I didn't know there was a secret pathway. That's pretty cool. Oh, there's two of them here. Nice. Is there only two, or is there like a third one? No, there's just two. Oh, we can't. We can't go through that way. Okay. I had to start part six. Oh, okay. Maybe I need to actually like 100% kill everything before I leave. Because it looks like nothing's respawning, so I don't think I killed these to begin with. What is over here? Nothing. What about in here? Oh, I literally just cannot go this way. Oh my guys, they've got me dying. I didn't realize they changed any of the the names when localizing. I know that like some of the characters like are American and stuff, but oh, can I can I leave now? No. How do I leave? <laughs> Wait, okay, I'm gonna have to like Google this shit because I'm like, why can't I leave? Lost Ark, how how to leave a dungeon. Uh oh, open your map and click on a tripod. Press F2 and play the song of escape. Wait, so there is no exit. Oh, okay, right. B bruh, okay, this is the first game I've seen. No exit. I did not actually realise that's how it worked. Okay. Well, now we know. Now we know. These demons, they won't stop rushing in. Right. What's, what's the heart thing? Oh, it's just a friend. Okay. Uh, so we need to go to the merchant camp, but I don't have... <laughs> Hello. Wait, I need to go like repair my gear as well. Oh well, we'll do the we'll do the quest first, and then we can always go back and repair it. Oh, press buttons at the right time to make a, a combo. See, I don't know what any of the combos are, so I've probably done a bunch of combos by accident, but I don't really know what I'm doing. And went from sticky fingers to zipper man. <laughs> Another was dirty bees done dirt cheap. Got changed to filthy axe at a reasonable price. <laughs> to me, that sounds better because it sounds more goofy. But oh, hello, big big demon, big scary demon. Uh, no Skyrim door. Let us get to flaccid pancake. <laughs> I just have to kill a bunch of ghosts. Hello. Oh, okay. You're not gonna leave me alone until I kill you. Oh, you're already a ghost, so I can't actually kill you. Oh, I just smell out most. Gather food that looks edible. Caravan member. Oh, they're all the way up there. Okay, hello. Oh, 
Oh, there's a boss standing over there. I want to go kill the boss. Oh. Oh, I just got yeeted. Cool. I killed the boss. Hello. You came. I searched on my way here, but I couldn't find the demon. Based on the direction it was heading, I think it's traveling toward Lutera. It doesn't look very hard. The other cell that we need to find the Ark just might be in Lutera. Let's hurry there. Bittersweet bun, while waiting for you, I asked the caravan to save two seats for us. I want to go with you, but unfortunately there was only one seat left in both the advance party and the second party. A civil war has broken out in Mount Zagros on the border of Lutera, and many soldiers are getting wounded every day. Do you mind if I first go to help tend to them? Fine, you can go heal people. I'll, I'll be a good person. Again in Lutera. Oops. Oh, I was worried we, not, we might not be able to eat. Vandal sent you. That kid, he's grown into a responsible man. Now we won't have to worry about food until we get to Mount Zagros. Thank you. Cool. Alright. Oh, wrong way. Dodo is great because I'll be having a great day and remember the gif of Kakyoin with the cherry of the whole team laughing in the desert. I think my favorite stand is Purple Haze. Why is that your favorite? Oh, uh, mind, I don't know what it is, so enlighten me. Priest told me about? I saved your seat. Are you ready? Then come to the gate. I'm taking in the caravan to the Lutheran gate. I'll see you there. Cool, now we need to just get in there. Oh, okay. We have to, like... Oh, the caravan's over here. I thought we had to, like, walk to the border. And I was like, are we not getting a teleport? Or... What's this? Oh, this doesn't look good. It seems longer than its screen time, and that's probably because it was dummy strong. <laughs> Oh, it's a vista. Okay, into Lutero we go. Oh, there's a boss over here. I want to kill the boss. Hello. Nice. It's Fugo's turn. I'll send a picture to the Discord. Oh, let's have a look. Um, yeah, I guess just stick it in either general or stream discussion. Hello. Oh, you're friendly. Oh, there's a lot of there's a lot of quests. Okay. Hello. Were you going to leave without saying goodbye? Well, thank you. I came to see you off. Thank you so much for everything. I don't remember who any of these people are except for Thunder. Please travel safely. May your new journey be blessed with the light. Thunder was cool. Your Yudia savior. Oh, okay, we run up to the gate and then suddenly run back. Everybody beware of the giant penguin with two sets of glasses just getting onto the back of the wagon. Okay, where in the world are we? Mount Zagoras. Oh, I need to get rid of a bunch of stuff again. Okay. So, a way to look at the 
Like the big world map. Ready to sail. Oh, I don't have a ship. Shadow of Nation. Nope. World map. UD a continent. Oh wait, we can just click on things. Okay. Yeah, I would have done all of this already, but like I don't remember any of it, so <laughs> Hello. Oh, you're the adventurer from Udia. <coughs> I've heard about you from Father Armin. The priest is currently at the Western Outpost. He seemed to be waiting for you. How do you get here first? Oh no wait, no, never mind. He went to Mount Zagros anyway, so. Hello. The border guard is extremely low on food right now. We need to make up for the food shortage by hunting wild game. But with so many wounded, we're quite short on manpower. Do you mind helping us get some food? Please bring it to Kane at the Western Outpost. Sure. I don't- like, I can't even remember why they're wounded. Like, what are they fighting? Are they fighting demons or...? I'm guessing so. There's a boss over there and everyone knows when there's a boss I have to go fight it. Oh. oh no. Hello. Oh, you're the boss. Beat the boss. Okay, let's have a look. Um, oh, that is cool. He is very purple. He is very, very purple. I like the color purple as well if you guys uh if you guys couldn't tell i got the centurion's notebook oh, it's gonna be more law cool we are now very law friendly right where am i even going oh this way uh oh here's the guy i'm supposed to talk to oh these are some angry balls Hello, it is I, the Angry Penguin. You That's returned. one big cannon. <gasps> Armin, we my favorite to character. We investigate the Eagle Seal, but we couldn't move because too many people were gravely wounded. If it's th if it's this bad at the guard post, things might be far worse at the Zagros Fortress. I implore you, please help the soldiers here a little more. I will go ahead and go to Zagros Fortress. Please talk to Denev, the captain of this outpost. Hi, Neville. How's it going? How's your evening? Hello, armored guy. Boar meat, huh? The meal fellow did good work. And thank you. If it weren't for you, everyone would have starved. I'll go ahead and see that the wounded are fed first. Angry penguin saves the day. Oh, I accidentally skipped his dialogue. Although we're barely getting by, thanks to the supplies you salvaged for us, it's still not enough. Could you please salvage anything useful from the piles of junk and deliver it to Denev? I can do indeed. Right. This looks salvageable. 
Is there anything useful left in here? Apparently there is. Hello, Denev. I need to talk to you twice. Hmm, this we could use. It just so happened that we needed stretchers to carry the wounded. Although Father Armin treated them, they would have died if we left them behind. Fortunately, there's a glimmer of hope now. We should be able to carry them to the fortress with this. Thank you. We really owe you for this. You're very welcome. As if cutting off our supply route wasn't enough, Sherrod had to launch a surprise attack. Oh, you're the one who's been helping Father Armin. Please ex excuse me. I couldn't hold back my anger. As you can see, there are wounded soldiers everywhere. If it weren't for Father Armin, more than half of them would have surely perished. And if it weren't for you, many more would have starved to death. Th I thank you with all my heart. I think of them as my sons and you saved their lives. May I be so bold as to ask for your help again? I'm rather short on people who can move about freely. I would appreciate it if you could help provide first aid to the wounded soldiers. I don't know how to provide first aid. I'm, a, I'm an assassin. My evening's doing good, thanks. How are you? I'm good, thank you. A little tired, but uh, just, just chilling thank with you. some... Some casual lost dark. Hello. I really thought that was it for me. Oh, thank you for the resubscribe, Nibble. I very much appreciate it. Oh, I feel a little better now. I need to actually put in some uh, sub perks, but I haven't thought of any yet. I need to do some hunting on the internet to think of really good sub perks now that now that I have subscribers. <laughs> out Thank of you woods. so much for the support, you have my guys. Gratitude. Father Armin said that he's headed to the Zagros Fortress. You can reach it if you keep going up here a little more. Tell the soldier at the gate about me and he'll let you in. Cool, I leveled up. I'm now really cool. Combat skills. Uh, oh, I got five skill points. Um, level 24. Um, I guess we'll just like level up some of these. Okay, that was only like one point. Um, well, this is at level 2 now. Oh, 28 out of 48 points. Okay. 1 out of 4 points. 2 out of 4 points. Oh, we can upgrade one of these now. So, Fist of Darkness. Element is now dark. Outgoing damage plus 15%. Element is now fire. On hit. Burns foe. Oh. Element is now water, on hit, and flicks frost. Move me speed minus 20%. I like Fist of Darkness because it sounds funny. And ob obviously I like being really edgy, as you as you guys know. Are there any of these that are close to leveling up as well? So apparently I really like going for swift fingers. Uh, I guess, yeah, I guess we'll just carry on leveling up these. Because I mean, I do use them. Go oh, on one point left. Um, sure, we'll level this again. <laughs> I really like going with some fingers. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> it seems I really liked fingers even for playing Elden Ring because they're obsessed with fingers in that game for some reason. I bet they'd be like over the moon when they saw AI hands. Have you guys seen AI hands? They're the most terrifying things in the world. Oh, it says main tiger. I gotta admit, I misread the tiger's name as Mario Tiger. And I was like, what? I was like, why is it called Mario Tiger? Oh, it's not. <laughs> oh dear. Right, okay. Let's not move away from the main quest because it does. It does take us to um, the next area. Yeah, one thing I do like about this game is that there isn't really a lot of back and forth with quests. Like, the quest ends like in the area that you're going, provided you complete it at the time you get it. Yeah. 
Oh, don't you guys love my my fist of darkness or whatever it was called? <laughs> it's such a bad name, I love it. Oh dear. Okay, I need to go this way. Hello. I don't mean to attack Hold. you. If you wish to enter, identify. Hmm? That's Captain Danis. Uh, you're with Father Armin. Please pardon my insolence. Yeah. Get fucked, Poo Poo Head. Father Armin is currently in the fortress. He's treating the poisoned soldiers. You'll be able to meet him inside the fortress. See, I kind of failed to realize why these guys are suffering so badly anyway. Ooh, Sagras Fortress. Oh. Oh, this is a dungeon. Okay. I mean, go just resting a moment, pull the muscle back. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Nibble. I uh, I hope you're feeling better soon. The yeah, uh, are not back pain at all. really hurts. What's over here? Oh, I guess that's to actually. Hello, Armin. Hang in there. You'll be well soon enough. Thank you. Oh, blessed priest. Ah, you're here. Right this way. Follow me. <laughs> I don't ever really love a dancing penguin with two sets of glasses on. Oh, dear. Right, is there anything else in this area? I'm assuming not. Might as well have a little look around. I'm also my cocoa fruit hunting. <laughs> Just a little glimpse standing up from a chair. Ooh, that sounds painful. Yeah, definitely go see a, a, a GP if uh, if it gets worse, Nibble. Hopefully all you'll need is some rest, but back pain really hurts so much, so I, I, I hope you feel better soon. Can I go this way? Oh, I can't go that way. And then it's like, nah, nah, bro. You need to follow the really kind guy. I can remember that, like... I don't know, he had some kind of dark secret. I think he's like half demon or something. I think that's all I can really remember about him. All I know is that he got... The only cutscene I can remember with him in it that was like... Particularly worth noting was that... He got really angry and like went like half demon and then got really upset after. You've come. I was here treating the soldiers. Once the treatment is finished, let's look into the eagle seal. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Thyrain, a knight of Lutera. Well met, Sir Thyrain. I am Armin. And this is my traveling companion. The angry penguin. I wanted to thank you for treating my soldiers. Their slow recovery has weighed heavily on me. Thanks to you, I have one less thing to keep me up at night. You must be exhausted. Let me get you a hot meal and some accommodations for the night. Oh, I love a hot meal and some accommodation. <laughs> oh. Target in sight. Oh, no, no witnesses. I mean, there's there's quite a few witnesses, my guy. Watch out! That there's there's a lot of witnesses. But okay, you do you, I guess. What happens if I just let them kill him? Yeah, I'm just saying. I'm not saying I'm gonna do it, but I'm just saying what if. Oh, fails a fire in his cup. Okay, he can actually die. Okay. I kind of want to name him Thyroid, but that's because his name sounds like Thyroid. <laughs> Secure the perimeter. Oh, he's a prince. Prince Thyrain, are you hurt? Oh, he's a prince. I wonder people are trying to Nothing assassinate him. For you to worry about. He was still on pretty high health. Highness. He's fine. I told you, I'm fine. He's it's fine. It's just a scratch. If I may, please hold still. What Can is the thing? 
Oh, he looks pretty. Pedro, Pedro the pink, the pink fox thing. Wow. Impressive. Fortunately, the wound was not too deep. I swear. Clearly, you're more than just a knight of Lutera. I swear, this whole game is just I'm people fanboying over Armin. Prince, these days. We can talk more about it over there. Yeah, I've got no idea what's going on with the story at the moment. Yeah, this this is this is Pedro, my uh, my pink fox pet thing. Um, he's really cute, and I love him dearly. Okay, I guess this area is like counted as a regular town now, which is good. Oh. Yeah, I don't think he really does anything. He kind of just follows me everywhere. Yeah, I wrote in my book of cool things. Uh, oh, I need to go repair my gear actually. I might fight. Yeah, I kind of wish he did as well, but he kind of just stands there. Unless he has been fighting this whole time and just haven't noticed. Desert light sword. Oh, that's actually better than my current, my current weapon. I don't know if it's actually worth buying things in this game, as in like items, because. Uh, is this better than... Yeah, it definitely is. Oh wait, no. Worse, I mean. Um, yeah, let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Uh, is this better or worse? That's more crit, but... Nah, it can go. I think my stats are fine. Um, wait. Oh, that's epic, and this is rare, and that's like way better. Okay, we need to hold on to that, actually. Oh, maybe I do actually need to read the, the stats and stuff, because, I mean, at least the game tells me when, like, something is better than my previous item. But, like, in the case of this, it's very debatable whether it's better or not, whereas this one it very clearly is, but it's a... For some reason, that's an epic, and that's a rare, and the rare is actually better. For some reason. Uh, oh, wait, we need to sell all of this kind of stuff. Sell that. Uh... Oh, wait, this is better. Okay. Um, just sell that, I guess. I'll sell that. And then we need to equip other, st equip other stuff. Okay, so we can equip... This one? No, not that one. Um, what, is it, what is that? Oh, okay. You've already completed the quest or completed it with another character. Okay. Fine by me. Oh, cool. Oh, cherry blossom. I don't know what a Makoko trail is, but it sounds very cute. Ooh. Oh, oh, that's cute. Summer night. Oh, dreaming. Dreaming is very cute. I think I'll take. I think I'll take the dreaming one. They have like little hats as well. Oh, that's so cute. <gasps> also get a Christmas one, but I kind of want to wear the the non-Christmas one. Guess we'll get the matching one. Uh, preview. Oh, <gasps> it's so cute. Look at it. No, oh, maybe I should have gone for cherry blossom because that's like a cute little. Oh, then again, this one has a bag as well. I'm guessing this is the female one, and that, that's- oh yeah, male, female. Oh, that's very cute. Perfect. Aren't I cute? <laughs> what even is this thing? <laughs> oh, I now match my pet in terms of ridiculousness. Oh, oh cool. Oh, okay, Lone Insects Ruins. Not in this area. Oh, okay. We need to we need to go back to Oshorn Hill. Uh, Solar Salt. That's the best way. Metro's time. Um. Yeah, I'll equip that. Uh. There we go. Oh. oh, I have a little trail effect. Oh, that's so cute. 
What is your character wearing? I don't even know, but I think it's cute. I think I might take off the helmet just so I can actually see my character's face, but I think it's adorable. I love it. Um, what is this? Oh, this. Maybe I should have read out the law before I just instantly got rid of it. Lone Demon's Rooms. Uh, do we already complete this? I'm looking at this stuff and it's all in previous areas, so I'm assuming I've already done it. But we can we can definitely check it out because I want to know what it is. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh. Oh yeah. Let's let's buy this sword because it looks way better. Right. Quit that. Uh, let's sell the really useless stuff. Um. Yeah, I think that's everything actually. Sell that. Nice. Okay, uh, where is it we're actually going? Oh yeah, I need to check my equipment durability. Gloves. Okay. Um, hello, Mr. Repairer. Repair equipped gear. There we go. I am now fully repaired. And prepared. Hello. Oh, there's another player. That's the first time I've actually seen another player. Thank you for your help. This could have been a real disaster. Oh, the prince is kind of hot. If it weren't for Father Armin, things could have gotten even worse. May I ask what brings you all the way here at a time like this? The Eagle Seal? That's an heirloom of the Lutheran dynasty, but how do you know about that? The Ark. I see. I'm a little taken aback to suddenly hear about something I've always thought of as legend. Well, even if it is an heirloom, it's not something so precious that we can't hand over to someone who saved our, sol our sh soldiers. After all, Lutera has managed to survive through the years without having to rely on such legends. However, the Eagle Seal is currently in Lutera Castle. Lutera Castle has been taken over by the current regent, Sherrit, since my father's death. I've been recruiting soldiers here in order to drive out the tyrant Sherrit. This place is currently in jeopardy, and I can't allow you to become embroiled in this danger too. We should be able to find the seal when we reclaim the castle. Please come back and see me then. I bet we're gonna just help him sort out the castle. Damn it. What are those guys? Storage keep mail. Oh, do I have any mail? No, I don't have any mail. Wait, why, do, why is there a specific NPC for mail when we can just check our mail at any time? Hello, Armin. It seems like Prince Thyrain is a man of character, just as they say. The way he heartily agreed to give us the royal heirloom. Moreover, he's been taking such great care of his men. It's as if they were his own brothers. I would like to help Prince Thyrain. How about you, Bundan? Well, I didn't actually answer, but apparently he's deciding for me. It's very cute. Just everyone else is wearing a suit of armor, and you all go around amongst them in that. I think it's perfect. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm not really uh, an angry penguin anymore. I'm more like an angry purple thing. I don't even angry Barney. Angry Barney the dinosaur. Because that's what I'm seeing at the moment. I kind of look like a slightly discolored Barney the dinosaur. <laughs> oh, just as I thought. I know you'd be willing to help. I'll be treating the soldiers here. It seems the, like the Lord of Mount Zagoras, Sir Meehan, was having trouble vanishing the supplies. Please give him a hand, Bun Bun. Yes, sir. Alright, open the chest. How much is inside? Oh, I can't just loot everything in the supply chest then. Hello. Why is he swinging his sword like that? He's gonna hit someone. Hello. Hmm. Is this the list of supplies? Oh, it's very detailed. This will be helpful. I was burdened with one problem after another, but I feel much better now that you've solved this one for me. Thank you. No problem, sir. I'm not entirely sure why you couldn't just walk over to that box and get it himself, but you never know with video games. I'm glad he appreciated it. I'm almost done with the treatment. 
Many were spared thanks to the guidance of Regulus. I don't know who Regulus is, but it's fortunate that we could help the people here. Oh. Uh, Alright, total firing. Hello. Thank you for helping me, Han. What a relief. Could I trouble you with one more request? I was actually about to send a declaration to all factions across Lutero before marching to Lutero Castle. However, Mihan is currently preoccupied with salvaging the fortress. And I'd like to leave this in the hands of someone reliable, giving its importance. Please, I'm counting on you. So he's just leaving me behind. Find Messenger Pigeon Wrangler. Oh, there's also a side quest over there. Hello, uh, William. This is the most normal sounding name I've heard in this game so far. Thanks to you, our soldiers are in much better shape now. Thank you so much. However, there are still many soldiers suffering from the poison, although Father Armin is looking after them. Finding and eliminating the cause will prove to be a faster solution. Could you possibly investigate the well nearby? Sure. We shall find out why uh, people are drinking nasty water. Spot something shiny in the well. Okay, I'm back. What did I miss? Um... Uh, you missed these nuts. Lamel got him. <laughs> this outfit's so ridiculous. Okay, bye! <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, Spess didn't like that. Is there something wrong with sparkly Barney the Dinosaur? <laughs> with my hair like clipping part of the way through my outfit. I investigate the half dissolved red powder. A powder that's not fully dissolved yet. Smells pungent. Ooh. Hello, William. Yeah. Oh, don't mean to attack him. The dancer has an elfing. <laughs> hmm, so it's this poison. Now that we know where the poison came from, we can do something about it. Well, I mean, we don't exactly know where it came from. We just found that someone put it in the well. The red fruit that grows on Mount Zagreus should serve as an antidote. Uh, I think we should be able to get uh, enough for this place. If it's alright with you, could you possibly help the Northern Outpost? There's a chance the folks there have also been poisoned. Please give the fruit to Leon at the Northern Outpost. Okay, wait, where's the, where's the pigeon wrangler? Oh, the pigeon wrangler's all the way up there. Okay. Actually, I might. What's the one that's. Spirit's robe. I might see if I can just buy tons of those, because. I think it might be helpful to have something that increases movement speed. Hopefully, the potion guy's got it. I think the dancing was great. Are you guys criticizing my dance moves? Are you guys. Are you guys criticizing my dance moves? Because <laughs> I think they're great. <laughs> I think they're really good. I mean, look at look at my absolutely giant thighs. <laughs> what even is this? <laughs> um. Hello. Oh, didn't mean to attack you. There we go. Uh, oh, okay. I can only buy healing potions. Rip. Okay. I guess just running normally. We've lost too many. We love sparkly Barney, Barney the Dinosaur. Where am I even going? Up here, okay. Might as well have a quick look for my cocoa fruits. Well, that's a very pretty, uh... <gasps> Reindeer! But it's not Christmas! Because we all know that reindeer only exist at Christmas. Alright, there's the tripod. Oh, it's snowing. Selectables. Oh, it's just bringing up the Makoko seeds. Okay. <gasps> boss! We all know that I must attack the boss. 
Oh, I'm frozen. Oh, okay, my attack is entirely missed. Oh well. Oh, I'm stunned. There we go. Why are red fruits? Those look very red. Oh wait, I'm not gonna be able to forage that because things are attacking me. Things don't like me very much. Okay. You, you shredded the cats. I'm sorry, the cats attacked me first. It had to be done. They were very naughty cats. Nobody likes naughty cats. No makoko fruit from the makoko tree. Hello. This place is kind of giving me Skyrim vibes. Going that way. Okay. Hello. Prince Thyrain sent you? Uh, no, no way. Aha, uh -huh, but of course. Prince Thyrain is finally. Ha uh, ha, that jerk of a regent's gonna wet himself. After all, the rightful king has finally appeared. It's time for my pretty pigeons to take action. Let's see. What the heck? All the pigeons are sick? Oh dear, it must be some kind of contagious disease. This isn't good. This is an emergency. Please go get me some crystallized water. It's a special spring water found in Manzagras that does wonders for this type of disease. Otherwise, I'll be letting down Prince Thyrain. Please, I'm counting on you. I'm sure the pigeons just didn't also get poisoned. Hmm? I've never seen you around before. Is this fruit? William sent you. Oh, I see it. It's an antidote. Thank you. Things are about to get really bad. I'll hurry and pass this out to everyone. Isn't it casually, like, really convenient that the antidote was, like, right next to the poison people? <laughs> I feel like it might be a great hunter as well, am I right? Actually, I brought it up because of this monster tiger called Regan living in the southern hills. It's so fearless and ferocious that it sometimes comes all the way to the fortress just to hurt people. We tried to catch it before, but too many have died or lost limbs trying. I'm sure you'd be able to hunt down that monster, though. I can try. I am especially good at hunting down monsters because I am a giant sparkly Barney the Dinosaur. Where am I actually going though? Ooh, some big boys. I really just did sit on four giant guys. Very stealthy. <laughs> oh, what's this? Investigate. Make a dense snowball. Oh, cool. What is that? Zagoras ice cap. Oh, okay. Everyone would love this. I forgot that you can try and charm NPCs. Might as well grab another one while we're here. Oh, okay, these guys just all respawn, and they're very angry. Okay, 
not say. What's this? Forage. Oh, the crystallized water. Is there anything over here in the corner? Oh, just more angry frozen men. Nope, oh, nothing in the corner. Kill the angry tiger. Nice. Okay, let's go back. Let's go back and give the water to the pigeons because it's very important, yes. Hello. Uh, good. The pigeons will feel better soon. I've already tied the messages to their feet, so you just need to open the cage door. <gasps> Yay, we get to get the pigeons out of the cage. Go, pigeon, go! To those suffering under the rule of Regent Sherrod, your days of misery will soon be over. I vow to bring the usurper to justice. Yay! And take back Lutera Castle. Yay, let's take back Lutera Castle. Thank goodness. A new hope dawns upon Lutera. Hey, adventurer. The pigeons are feeling swell thanks to you. They'll probably want to fly out to every corner of Lutera now. Oh, right. What was his name? Armin, was it? There's a priest looking for you. Why don't you go see him? I swear... I swear that Armin must be stalking me. Hello. Yeah. You really took down Re... Re... Regeet. Regeet? I'm, go I'm... Regeet? I'm going with that. The people at the fortress can rest easy now, too. That trick creature caused so much trouble for everyone. I'm sure everyone appreciates what you've done. I know I do. You're very welcome. Right, where are we going next? Uh, oh, we need to go back to back to the fortress. Right, let's teleport back because I can't bother to walk. Did you know that there's a fortress to the east of here that's now in ruins? Five long centuries ago, one of the final battles against the demons was fought there during the Chain War. No one knows exactly what happened anymore, as details were lost to history. They do say that there's a tombstone there. If you happen to go to the eastern ruins, could you possibly check out the tombstone? I can do. I definitely can do. Damn it. What are those guys? Hello. Greetings, adventurer. The new recruits sometimes wander into the eastern ruins, only to get themselves killed or badly hurt there. Word is that there are ghosts out there. If it's alright with you, could you possibly lay them to rest? So I need to kill ghosts. I don't know how that quite works, but I'll try. The treatment of poison victims in Zagros Fortress is nearly complete. However, it seems they were terribly short on supplies. Everyone is having a particularly tough time due to a shortage of the iron we use to make weapons. A gentleman by the name of Meehan tells me that there is an abandoned fortress nearby. He said that there must be weapons left behind there from a previous war, and a plan to retrieve them. However, it would be too risky to send the soldiers who are still recovering from being poisoned. Would you be able to bring the weapons instead of the soldiers? Ooh, weapons. We can do that. Uh, oh, it's over there. I'm just gonna go to the tripod, because I can't really be bothered.
Okay. Defeat the spirit knights. Hello, you look tough. <laughs> attack entirely missed, but oh well. Wait, that's a hidden Makoko scene. That was sneaky beaky. Oh, this guy's kind of tough. Hello. Oh, okay, I don't know where that was going. There we go. Oh, there's a boss over here. I did just literally one shot the boss. Okay. Away the dust from the monument. I will not stop resisting until my last breath for my family, my friends, and the future children who will populate this land. Oh, he sounds angry. Everyone in this game is so angry. Yeah! Hello, Prince Hotman. How did you know we were short on iron? Hmm. Mihan was about to handle that. Thanks to you, we can let our soldiers rest a little more. I continue to be indebted to you and Father Armin. I'm not sure if a mere seal would suffice. I came to Zagra's fortress to gather troops to fight by my side. Thankfully, many have volunteers. As things stand, however, they are not fully trained. If they enter the battlefield like this, they'll be slaughtered in an instant. Their training captain, Mac, is trying his best. But it's likely a burden too great for him to bear alone. Would you go to Mac and help him finish up their training? I'm sorry that I keep asking you for such favours. However, we are in dire need of someone with your capabilities right now. I'll be preparing to move the troops. Come find me at the rear outpost when the training is complete. Please, I'm counting on you. So that's what's written on the tombstone, I see. They may have lived five centuries ago, but they're no different from us. They were all concerned for their family, friends, and children. I have nothing but the highest respect for these men. Thanks to their final stand against the demons, we were able to exist today. This gives me courage. Thank you, adventurer. I'll pass this on to the other soldiers as well. Oh, I gained wisdom points of two. I don't exactly know what wisdom points do, but... Like, do, do they do any... Oh, okay. Permanent increase from potions. Oh, okay. This is the ability to solve difficult problems. Ooh. Okay, 
Okay, I guess it's just when talking to NPCs. Have you been to the Eastern Ruins? I was just getting worried about all the soldiers getting hurt there. Thanks to you, the soldiers will be suffering a little less now. As always, thank you. You're very welcome. Right, where are we going now? Speak with training Captain Mac. Oh, he's all the way down there. Okay. Alright, I think I'll play Lost Ark up until we retake Lutera Castle, and then I think I think I will I will call it for tonight. I think that would be a pretty good place to stop. Hello. Oh man, this is tough. Excuse me, adventurer. Could you lend me a hand? Moving all that stone over there has been so tough. Seems like the assassins who came for the prince made a hole in this wall. We want to plug it up real good this time. Yeah, <laughs> he said plug. Okay. Pick up. Use trot to get... Okay. Temporary movement speed bonus. How do I put this down? Oh, skill not ready. Oh, it's R. Okay. Oh, that was it. I only needed to move one. <laughs> that should do it. They won't be able to break through the so easily next time. It was tough for the wounded soldiers to carry all that heavy stone. What a relief. It all went very well thanks to you. Thank you so much. No problem. <gasps> There's a boss. I need to go kill the boss. Because it wouldn't be me if I didn't kill the boss. Oh, I forgot I had a mount so I can move faster. Wow, I could have walked faster this entire time. Oh, shit, I'm stunned. Ooh. There we go. Easy boss. Can we go up this ladder? I guess not. Um, my guess is that there's nothing else around here. Hello, angry tigers. Is this a new character you're carrying on an existing playthrough? I'm carrying on an existing playthrough, but um, this character. So this character was like level 21 before, and I. It's been so long since I played this game. I don't remember what's happening. Like, <laughs> uh, the only thing I remember is that there's a, there's a bunch of evil demons, and Armin is like a half demon or something like that. That's that is all I remember about the story. So heavy. Apparently we're looking for something called the Ark, and it's very powerful, and we got to find it before the uh, the hot demon guy does. Oh, there's a Makoko fruit. Um, but that's all I know so far. That's all I can remember about the story. Why did I ever volunteer to join you? So, you're the one who saved Prince Thyrain. Your reputation precedes you. <laughs> yes, that is I, Sparkly Biny the Dinosaur. That's apparently his new name. He's concerned about the training too. His Highness really does care about his people, doesn't he? Even so, I'm a bit disappointed that he's underestimated old Mac here. The training is nearly done. <clears throat> the only problem is morale. There's nothing like music to help cheer up the soldiers. But I still haven't heard a sound from this Mala fellow, even when I told him to play some music ages ago. Sorry, you, sorry, but could you go check on Mala? He's the fellow down there. I don't care. Even if you have to kick his butt, make him play some music. I've never played it, so it's all new to me. That's fair enough, Nibble. It is basically new to me as well. I've got no idea how, like, why I do so much damage to things. Maybe it's because of my class and stuff. But yeah, I, I like nearly one-shot bosses, which is kind of weird. I like mini bosses rather. And this is the only game that I've seen where I can literally just one-shot bosses. Apparently, it is supposed to play similarly to like Diablo and stuff like that. But I've I've never played Diablo either. Who are you? And why'd you just try to kick me? Just kicked him. Oh, Captain Mac. Well, this is embarrassing. Actually, I have a sore throat, so I can't play my trumpet. I have a terrible cold, you see. Why are you looking at me like that? A cold is a terrible illness. I feel like my throat is about to rip out every time I blow my trumpet. Uh, so, if you want to hear me play, at least go fetch some herbs from over there. I heard the silver bush leaves are particularly effective. Why didn't I get some myself? I, um... Uh, Wanted to slack off. Um, <clears throat> shut up and go get me those herbs. Hmm. That sounds like a bit of a sussy excuse right there. 
I don't know how much I believe him. Well, I guess that's a little better. Do you know the Song of Valor, the national anthem of Lutera? No? Then let me explain. Even the toughest lad from Lutera can't help but get nervous during the first battle. When I was a fresh recruit, the more seasoned soldiers would always play me the song. It raises your spirits and makes your heart beat faster, you see. You don't believe me, huh? Believe it or not, my performance fetches quite a high price, so listen closely. Yes, play your trumpet for me. I love I loved your trumpet playing. Well, how'd you like that? If you liked it, why don't you learn it yourself? The Pride of Lutero, the Song of Valor. Yay, I can now play it. Uh oh there it is. Cool. Right. Did I ever me. volunteer to join the I army? could tell even before you came to me. I could hear the soldiers humming along all the way from here. Good work. I know that Mala guy would slack off. I better set him straight soon. Vince Thyrain is near the rear outpost. Could you report him that training is complete? I'd like to put his mind at ease. Yes, sir. To Thyrain, the hot prince. Right, I can use my cool mount. Any you guys love this? I think it was like a Twitch drop from ages ago. It actually does mean I can get around a bit easier now without um Hello. It's over. Mach is truly amazing. I wouldn't have been able to do the same in such a short time. I always have much to learn from those around me. I feel the same way about you and Father Armin. I cannot thank you both enough for all the help you've given us. We're about to take the trainees and head to Lake Bart. We'll link up the remainder of our forces there. We would be indebted to you if you and Father Armin could grace us with your presence. The village has a beautiful lake. It's well worth the journey. Oh, fine, if you insist. Barney the dinosaur in a hobby in a hobby car. I've also got a cool horse as well. We all love Barney the dinosaur on the back of a horse. They say the region has a huge Oh I can jump, that's pretty cool. Okay, there doesn't seem to be any extra stuff around here. Unless there's anything up here. Any hidden Makoko fruits from the Makoko tree? Doesn't look like it. Right. Actually, I kind of prefer the the hover mount. Oh, there's a booster. I didn't even know there was a booster. That's pretty cool. Okay. There's our favorite here, priest. Adventure. I came here with Prince Thyrain, but he went ahead to Lake Bar Village when he heard an army was approaching. The troops guarding the outpost also moved with him. This gentleman, Lloyd, informed of us the, of the approaching army. Although I was able to provide first aid, the wounds he sustained required long intensive care. I'll also be heading out to Lake Bar Village now. Please take good care of Lloyd. And when his breathing stabilizes, change advantages. Hello. Stop injuring Father yourself. Armin sent you. Thank you very much. Yeah, the horse doesn't really for the kids that they hop in the car though. Perfect. 
<laughs> we do love Barney the Dinosaur on a hover car. As you can tell by the armor I'm wearing, this old soldier served in the ranks of Regent Sherritt's forces. I merely followed my orders as a member of the Royal Army, but it always pained me to do so. I had to confiscate grain from starving presents and arrest the innocent. I even had to watch some of them die. That's why I decided to surrender to Prince Thyrain. Although deserted, my unit took a toll on this old body of mine. When the pursuers finally got to me, death seemed fairly certain. But then Father Armin saved me. This pain is nothing compared to the crimes I've committed over the years as a soldier for the Regent. Go ahead and go to Lake Bar Village. I should be fine now. Prince Thyrain could use all the help he could get. How far away is Lutera Castle? Shining Ridge. Oh, okay. Need to visit an area to view. What's this? Oh, I have a skill that can be leveled up. How many points? Oh, I've got another five. Okay, um... I guess let's just level up some of these. Oh. Right, open weakness. Von Blaze attack landing. Grant an open weakness debuff. Uh, let's increase crit rate and AoE radius. Um... Yeah, I kind of like the AoE radius, actually. We like attacking more things at once. So we'll go with that. Oh. Oh no. These don't really like bears. Nope, I don't know where that was aiming for. Oh, do I have any better equipment? Uh, this stuff is not better. No, none of this is better. How far away is this well? Oh, it's all the way over there. Okay. Time for hover car. I've got fruit from the local tree. No. It's so loud, the Zorba car. Lake Bar Village. The army led by Thyrain headed to Lake Bar Village. Hurry and join them. Oh, it's gonna be another mini. mini dungeon, sorta. Of. What's going on in here? Oh. Oh, there it is. Lots of soldiers. Oh, lots more soldiers. Guild announcement roast chicken for lunch. Oh wait, no, that's my own guild. I only just realized. <laughs> it's been far too long, dear prince. Dear prince. Hmm, is this your army? You couldn't possibly be thinking of using this rabble against Lord Sherritt, would you? The throne belongs to its rightful owner. And my spies tell me you haven't even been able to activate Vanquisher. Vanquisher sounds really edgy. It's time to yield the sword, disband this gang of criminals, and plead for mercy. And we may let you live. Oh. If Sherritt really wants this so badly, he's welcome to come fetch it. Brave, but foolish words, young prince. You will regret this, boy. Boy. <laughs> oh, I want to kill the Let commander. Let him go. We don't kill messengers, even rude ones. Oh, coward!
Oh, he's just leaving. But I need to speak to you. Where are you going? Hello. Oh, good. You've arrived safely. I was actually standing in the middle of their encounter. As for the prince, he seems to have gone to the lake. I'm a bit worried, seeing him so glum. But now I know why this place is called Lake Bar. He gives me like huge like moth from sure is an heirloom Fire for the Emblem Lutera vibes. Dynasty. I guess that was the point. It's supposed to glow when held by the rightful heir to the crown. That's how my ancestors proved their worthiness. So can I hold it? Which is also why Sherrod seeks Vanquisher for himself. But it won't even show the faintest glimmer in my hands. What does that say about me? That maybe I should hold the sword instead. Because player syndrome. Oh, I need to encourage him. Oh, okay. It's like an emote. Okay. Who doesn't love being encouraged by... <laughs> by sparkly Barney the dinosaur? <laughs> Are you trying to make me feel better? Don't worry. This is not something I obsess over. Winning this war is the only thing I worry about now. My worthiness comes later. Sire, we're under attack! The region's forces are here! Oh no. Let's go. Alright, let's go beat up some mini bobinis. Defeat Norse Wet. Oh, I accidentally used like other consumables that I didn't mean to use. Hello! Hello, Norse Wet. We have defeated Norsewet. Spare my life, Your Highness. I, I was only following orders. Following orders? Did you really just say that? That was a broken blade. Innocent villagers are dead by your hand. Kill him. Do you have no will of your own? Can you not see the difference between right and wrong? Kill him. You are no true knight of Lutera. You are responsible for these atrocities, and you will face justice for them. I have spoken. Take him away. Your Highness, you must not spare his life! Yeah! Your Highness, you must not spare his life! Long live King Yeah, Tyrant. you deserve it! <laughs> you deserve it! Take him away, boys. <laughs> Are the rumors true? Okay, now we can grab the uh the tripod here. And get rid of really useless things in my inventory gun. Um goodbye. Is this better or worse? That's worse. Hmm. Yeah, get rid of all that. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. What sell junk? Huh, apparently, don't have any junk. All the harm done to the villagers is my fault. That Norse wet fellow. He clearly said the raiders will appear again, but you can't let them repeat such atrocities ever again. 
Yes, sir. This time, we'll make the first move. The enemy is in camp south of the hill. I've been briefed about this by the scout. We can't just sit back and wait for the raid group to come. Let us defeat Sherrod's raid group. Hello. The raid group is being supplied by Sherrod himself. They not only have a steadier stream of supplies than us, but also better quality weapons. But there's no reason to feel down about this. We can just steal the good stuff from them. Yay, stealing. We love stealing in video games. I do it all the time. Hello. Uh, ahem. Adventurer, is it true that you're going to attack the raid group? Yes, just in video games. Wow, Mark. I know a thing or two about strategy, you see. The raid group is an ex expeditionary force, which means they also have to take supplies and rations with them. If you look around the encampment, encampment you'd find water containers where they keep their port- I misread that as portable water, and I was like, isn't water always portable? I do look like your outfit is made out of the spray on shoes with, from Cloudy for the chance of meatballs. Wait, I need to I need to look that up. I don't remember what that looks like. Hold on. Cloudy with a chance of meatballs. Um was it shoes? Spray on shoes. Oh my yeah, no, it kinda does. To me it looked a bit more like Barney the dinosaur, but like covered in sparkles, like queer vampire. Barney the Dinosaur. <laughs> uh, I don't know what you guys are talking about. I absolutely adore my Barney the Dinosaur armor. <laughs> but hello King Noah, how are you doing? Alright, so they, uh, they, you'll find water containers where they keep their, their potable water. How about you break them all to make them suffer from a water shortage? Yeah, yeah I like breaking stuff. I do really like breaking stuff. Okay. Um Everything is fine at the village. Where am I even going anyway? Oh, okay, just straight straight down. Meow. Oh, I got stuck on something. Meow. Oh, there's a boss. I want to fight the boss. Hello. Oh, there's a lot of enemies. Oh, I got yeeted. Rubine had a satisfying dinner. Did it did it taste good? That is the question. I mean I guess it must have if it was satisfying, but like leave me alone, okay. <laughs> What's this thing? Oh, <gasps> it's a mococo fruit from the mococo tree. And I could have put more spice in. Oh, King Nowhere could have been a bit more spicy. Huh? <laughs> a little bit more spicy. We all love a bit of spice. I'm sorry. Except I'm not, I'm really not sorry. <laughs> I didn't know you could bring up the map like on the other lay like that. Spice is the spice of life. Indeed it is. Uh, angry elite raid group. Who's next to die? You are next. Oh, that guy got yeeted. Okay. Alright, let's steal their weapons. The weapons shine like they are brand new. Oh, there's a macaco fruit from the macaco tree. Oh, I don't know where that was going. Oh, that was a lot of blood. 
You know, I'm gonna say the Makoko fruit from the Makoko tree every single time I find one of those now. Defeat Raid Group Captain Jacquerat. Okay, where is he? Uh, oh, he's over on the other side. Okay. Well, we can smash some water containers. There's also a mini boss over here. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Okay. Need to watch my health a bit more. Hello. Smashy smashy. Tell me chat, do you guys enjoy smashy smashy? Depends on what is getting smashed. If it's barrels. I do quite enjoy smashing barrels. Right, okay, we now need to just find a couple more weapons to steal, to plunder, to obtain through nefarious means. Oh, we can just go back to this rack again, actually. But we're gonna have to, like, kill these guys first. Come in, angry people. I don't know what the icon above that guy means, but... Oh, yes. See, he never gets it. I like instantly respawned again. He respawned quickly. There we go. Okay. On to defeat raid group Captain Jacquerat. If he's not a giant rat, I'm gonna be disappointed. Okay. Uh, let's teleport back to Lake Bar. Okay, who doesn't love Barney the dinosaur with two pairs of glasses on, playing the flute and teleporting? Great job. Now I'll be, they'll be a little too thirsty to fight. Although we can't face them head on in our current shape, this should ch change things up a bit. Every time they come to fill their canteens, we can ambush them. I think I make an outstanding tr strategist, don't you? I should apply to become a, an officer later. Take my weapons. Oh wow, you brought us quite a fine assortment. 
Now our men should put, be able to put up a proper fight. That regent fool. We really hit him where it hurts this time. Yeah, we hit him in the balls. Good work. Because that will probably now really the hurt. village will be out of harm's way. As always, I have nothing but gratitude for Armin and you for all that you've done. However, I uh, never mind. We've got bigger problems to worry about. What are We've our bigger problems? managed to defeat most of the enemies who raided Lake Bar. If it weren't for you, it would have taken much longer. However, the village's blood has been shed. I'd like to provide recompense to the villagers of Lake Bar. Could you ask Chief Horden about the extent of the damage to the village? He's right next to you. You can ask him yourself. Greetings. I am Horden, the village chief. The damage to the village? Ten wounded, two killed. One of the casualties was only eight years old. If the prince hadn't responded quickly, many more would have perished. We have nothing but gratitude for his help, and he wants to compensate us. Could you tell him that he doesn't need to worry about that sort of thing? Because he's a good person. Eight years old? He's only a child. Is that so? Even a young child like that? And all because of me. I couldn't even protect my own people. I failed them. At this rate, perhaps it's only to be expected that the vanquisher does not glow. Apologies, I'd rather spend some time alone right now. Wow, he's really sad all the time. Hmm. Prince Thyrene appears devastated. It seems he doesn't fully believe in himself. However, I think Prince Thyrene is perfectly suited to become the king. Can we find out exactly why he doesn't seem to have much confidence in himself? We should give him a pep talk. I know, he's he's kind of relatable, this guy, I won't lie. Prince Thyrene really values his people. This feels like the end times. We need a crown. Dad says a king needs to wear a crown. We need a crown. Oh, he probably blames himself for all the atrocities Regent Sherrod has been causing in the kingdom. This feels like the end times. So basically, he feels really guilty. You know, well, that's fair enough. I see. I've heard how chaos has swept across Lutera. It's because of the tyranny of Regent Sherrod, isn't it? Prince Thyrain must believe that the people are suffering because of him. However, the people don't seem to think that way. How can we relay that message? Bun Bun, do you know the fable of the Iron Crown? I've read it myself before. I hear it's a famous tale in Lutera. There was once a prince who was beloved by everyone. The people gathered their scrap iron to make a crown for this prince. The prince graciously accepted the crown and used it during his crowning ceremony. Like the story, perhaps we should show Prince Thyrain how the people really feel. Could you ask, ask Chief Fordon about what he thinks? Yeah, let's make him a crown. I want to make him an iron crown. crown. Are you talking about a steel crown? Well, he said iron, not steel, but... Actually, we've been meaning to pay back Prince Thyrain for his help as well. I guarantee that not a single villager would oppose the idea. We've all seen how distressed the prince was over us. However, I'm worried about the iron to make the crown. Considering how short supplies are right now, well, it would be difficult to pr procure such materials. But we'd like to get the nicest crown we can for the prince. Could you perhaps drop by the Linus Memorial in the south? The peddlers are gathered there. We could ask for their support. In the meantime, I'll make the preparations to make the crown. Yay, we'll be a nice person. Oh, I don't mean to pick up that potion. We can go fishing. There's fishing in this game. Not fishing. Okay, time to see if fishing is actually any good in this game. Right. Fish trap installation. Oh, we need a special... We need a special skill. Wait, what did it say it was? Um, that's combat skills. In a special skill. Which skill though? Do I even have the skill? I must fish. Uh Well it's B, but I'm not so sure what it's referring to. Codex? What does that even do? Well, what does this stuff even do? I don't... Huh? 
Oh well, I'm sure we will find out how to fish later. Right, where's the memorial? Oh, it's all the way down there. Okay. It is time to get out the hoverboard. Everything is fine at the village. I've already killed this mini boss, but I'll have a donut gun. Hello. I'm Phobus, the peddler. I'm not a child. I'm a proud peddler. He looks very childlike, though. Oh no, don't do the logic of being actually 200 years old. Huh? A crown for Prince Thyrain? You're asking us if we can make contributions? Are you seriously asking us if we can do this? Of course we can! I'm a merchant of Lutera, the Kingdom of Courage. Don't you ever underestimate us. This is all the money I have. I hope the folks at the Lake Bar Village will keep their chins up. Why don't you try asking the other peddlers as well? I'm sure they'll help. Hello. <laughs> Crown. <laughs> ah, that's an interesting story. I'll gladly give you one if it's for Prince Thyrain. It's an investment. Prince Thyrain is definitely worth a big investment. Aw. Unlike Sharon, he genuinely cares about his people. Take this too. Adventurer, have you heard of Linus, the legendary peddler? I admire him so much. A long time ago, when Lutero was embroiled in war, he supplied the army to save Lutero without taking a single coin. He's a hero. All the peddlers of Lutero admired Linus. So we gather here on his memorial day in, in remembrance of his spirit. If you're interested, why don't you check out the memorial plaque? Oh, I'm very interested. This monument is clean and well taken care of. Those who invest in only what they see are fools. And those who invest for profit alone will not last. In people, there is worth beyond face value. That's not what the subtitles say, but okay. <laughs> How was it? Maybe it all felt a little unfamiliar, since you're not a peddler. But I want to become an admirable gentleman of Lutero one day, just like him. Maybe one day you'll see a majestic memorial of Phobos next to that one. Nice. Hmm. Horror. Have you been to the peddlers? As expected, Lutera's merchants are quite different. I've told uh the Umar blacksmith to craft a crown. Take this. The Uma people are famous for their master artisanship. Er uh, will certainly create a masterpiece. Create a cool crown. Actually, what is this something to do? <gasps> a cook! There's cooking in video games! Oh, I don't have any, any of the ingredients for it. Ripening anti hair loss agent. An anti hair loss agent that still needs some more aging. Uh huh. Its miraculous effect of reviving dead hair roots has made it the only help for terminal stage baldies. Grow! Grow! What? <laughs> what even is this for? Okay, apparently I need a hair plant, but... Okay. Oh, he looks cool. Who are you? He looks like a deep Was rock electric character. A crown for the prince? <laughs> he really does. And you've come to the right place. I'm Ur, the world's best Umar blacksmith. And don't let anyone tell you different. Well, hurry up, show me what materials I got to work with. He really does look like a character from Deep Rock. I mean, look at that not bit. Bad, but also not enough. Unless this prince has the world's tiniest head. 
I need more materials to work with. Lucky for you, Lake Bar should have everything you need. Oh. Take this. It's a secret recipe passed down by the Umars. If you want to create a great crown, gather up the ingredients here and deliver them to Mirren. Cool, I got some... Uh, oh. oh, okay. So that's what pressing B actually does. Okay. Now we can fish. Relic search throw. Hunting. Ooh. Fishing pole? Oh, I don't have a fishing pole. Okay, I guess we cannot- we still cannot fish. What's the screen bar? Oh, life energy. Okay. That's pretty cool. Raiding blacksmith's secret technique. Pure gold of the field. Not all that glitters is gold. Not everybody who holds a hammer is a master artisan. Not all who are born of royal lineage can sit on the throne. Nobility is achieved only by grinding and polishing the raw- raw- qualities of the royal with that in mind i shall i there are words i will share with you the secret of how to get noble iron from a pile of scrap iron first we use molars of wild animals as fuel for the furnace using the molars as fuel strengthens the flames the higher the temperature of the bellows the easier it is to oxidize iron the molars of the lake bore especially good as they are hard and waterproof second there's a stannery method using crayon crystals when heat is applied while well, iron and crayon crystals are mixed together the impurities evaporate with the crayon crystals, and only pure iron remains. The crayon crystal can very rarely be obtained when killing crayon near, um, near Lake Bar. You'll more likely find it in red crayon rather than ferocious crayon. Once enough molars and crayon crystals have been collected, then it should be pretty easy to extract pure iron. Well, easy for someone who knows what they're doing. Best to leave the actual process to a martyr's artisan or one of their apprentices. Okay. Right. Okay, let us let us do some some exploring all around Lutera. Right, I think I think I'll probably get to a point where we give uh, we give Thyranus crown and then uh, and then call it a night. I was gonna wait until we beat Sherrit because I want to beat up Sherrit, but I do actually think uh, we will be here all night if I were to try and complete the entirety of Lutera. Oh. Let's accept this. Right, um... Oh, we've nearly got that my last. On we go. Oh, that's the wrong way. Come here, boars and wolves. Okay, I just need to find a couple more wolves. Oh, there they are. Oh, I didn't hear anything. I'm bad. Oh, nice, that's a level up. points left. I do tend to use this one a lot so we'll go with this one. Okay we can have concussion, increases the skill stagger level from mid to high, uh, damage to challenge or lower foes, plus 30%. We're attacking, charge four meters forward, pushing foes. Damage to 60%. I'm gonna push. I'm gonna push them. All right. Uh, guide mining using a pickaxe. Twitter master of trade skills, a weller. Guess we can't. Can we use this? Oh wait, no, I don't have a mining tool. Okay. Yeah. 
stone head. Right, where are the- I don't know what a crayon is. Okay, I said it- I said it was less likely to find him ferocious crayon. I don't know what a crayon is, but- Oh, there we go. Hello there. Uh, hello. I'm Mirin. I heard from Master Ur. You're crafting a crown, aren't you? Mullers and crown crystals. This should be enough to refine to the, the iron. Here we go. A piece of shining iron. I hope it goes to the person who best fits the iron crown. Okay, I'm back again. What did I miss? I mean, don't threaten me. I'll do it again. I'll do it again. <laughs> Right, uh, deliver ingredients to uh, Let's teleport back to Lake Bar then. I also need to get a fishing rod and a pickaxe and try out this mining and fishing stuff. See how good it is in this game. Oh. Actually, does this guy have a better weapon? Oh. Uh, peaceful lake chest piece. Uh, is this better? Oh, it's slightly better actually. Yeah, okay. Right, we'll pop this on. Wait, where is it? Uh, purple items. Here we go. Mm. Oh, that's the thing I literally just bought. Also, are these any good? No, not really. Yeah. Wait, get rid of titles. Um, first one I did buy the chess piece. It was called like peaceful thingy. Oh. Yeah. Oh, maybe I didn't actually properly buy it. Can I not? There we go. Okay. No, I didn't actually buy it. There we go. So get rid of that. Uh, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Uh, get rid of that. And that. And that. Alright. Alright. Hello. A song has passed down in Link Bar of the Terror. When the moonlight shines over the crown, the sound of pickaxes drives the night out. To make a crown for the highest one, workers of the lowest position take all the troubles. It is in the hands of the workers who take care of life, there is calling to lead history. Bun Bun, at this historic moment, shall we go mining together? As long as you have a pickaxe, you can mine ore. But I don't, I don't have one. Um... <laughs> He's definitely well, a deep character. Let's see if you screw this up. Hmm. Actually, this stuff's not bad. Okay, one fancy crown coming right up. Oh, the way I swing my Barney ass. Bonk. Came out good. <laughs> good for me is like a perfect masterpiece for anyone else. Take it. Oh, that's a very fancy looking crown. If you collect natural materials and bring them to a trade skill expert like me, they can make you useful stuff. There are all sorts of trade skill experts out there. There are cooks, alchemists, you name it. Be sure to uh, pay them a visit. Now grab your crown and get going. I got work to do. Cool. Okay. Let's buy... Okay, I guess I'm just gonna buy all of the... 
sure. We'll buy one of every skill. There we go. Um. Right. Oh, the deep rock character loves me. Awesome. I'm gonna have to say goodnight. No problem, Nibble. Thanks for hanging out, and I hope you have a lovely night. A lovely sleep. No problem, and I will hopefully see you next time. Good night. Sleep well. Oh, it's another player. Oh. Coronation? That's out of the blue. What do you mean? What? I see. So that's what's been going on. No wonder things have been busy around here for some reason. I am undeserving of such kindness, but I am truly grateful. Very well. Please proceed with the crowning ceremony. Traditionally, the royal crowning of Lutero is held at a place called the Shining Ridge. It just so happens to be nearby. You said the crowning ceremony was Armin's idea. The coronation requires a priest. Please tell Armin that I'd like him to preside over the ceremony. We can do. Hello. Have you heard the good news about Prince Thyrene? I'm going to prepare some food to celebrate with other people, but it looks like we are short on ingredients. Can you catch some fish? Master of Trade Skills Awella will take care of what you catch and give you rewards when you're done fishing. Now head to the fishing spot. Awesome. Oh. There's Armin. You've completed the crown. Chief Hordan told me. It's fortunate that the peddlers made such generous contributions. Great work. What did the prince say? Excuse me? He wants me to preside over the ceremony? I do not have that right. I am unworthy of carrying out such a noble task. I'll be glad to attend the crowning ceremony, but I think the priest of Lake Bar should preside. Everyone's really got low confidence, Armin. haven't they? Refused. That's too bad. But I think there's still a chance. Since he said he'll attend, there should still be an opportunity to persuade him. I would really like for Armin to do it. You feel the same, don't you? Now, let's head to the Shining Ridge. Right, there's the Shining Ridge. Oh, it's quite a distance away. Hoverboard time. Let's go crown our friends. I don't think I'll be able to hoverboard over whatever this stuff is. Oh, can we not go this way? Oh, I guess not. Okay. There's got to be something up here, though. Like could maybe a macaco fruit from the macaco tree. No, there really is nothing here. Okay, that sucks. Probably actually quicker to teleport over there. And then go around. Alright, pickaxe G. Oh, I need to equip the mining tool. Oh, like that. There we go. Clang, clang, clang. Nice. Oh no, don't attack me when I'm... There we go. Oh wait, hold on. Oh. Of stuff. Cool, what did I actually get? Uh, gold reward. Oh, it's just permanent stats, it looks like. 
Right, scroll skills. Oh, okay. I don't know why they didn't give you this at the beginning of the game, though. Like the uh, foraging stuff, or oh, the the other skills that are that is. And they made you wait until now to do it because it reminds me a lot of Black Desert because you can do the same thing. But you have more freedom because you can do it from the start of the game, provided you have the, t the tools, and you can literally buy the tools in the first village. <laughs> Moonlight Miner is a double-edged sword. Oh. oh. Where are we going? Over here. Big boss. Yeah, I don't even know what a crown is, but... Alright. Ooh. Shining Ridge is where King Lutero was born. The monument of High Lutero was found in King of Heroes, located where his birth home was. The monument lists his achievements. This looks a bit spooky. We'll be at the coronation site soon. I hope you'll do me the honor of performing the ceremony. It is a holy ceremony. I must regrettably decline. You can't be serious. Who's holier than a priest? He's like half but demon, that's why. I am... Wait. <laughs> Something's here. Oh. That sounds bad. Oh, that doesn't look good. Run! It literally looks like Rengar from League. A really big Rengar. We must save them. Insects. That's all these are. Oh, one gun. I'm pressing like one instead of like actual right buttons as well. to the next bit. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Frankly, I did a lot of damage. Makoko fruit from the Makoko tree. Might be a Makoko fruit this way. Oh, 
Maybe not. There is no Makoko fruit from the Makoko tree. Wow, I'm actually like really far behind in these. It's a lot of bones. Big boy. Oh god, that was a lot of damage. I've been disassociated and don't worry Mike, it's all good. We're having just a, a casual Lost Ark stream today. Oh, what is this? That looks evil. Okay, apparently I can't do anything there. Four enemies I just fight. Okay, here we go. We're at the scary big Rengar like enemy. It really does look like Rengar, do you? Rango. Great timing. What? How are you still alive? He entirely missed. He's like Warwick and Rengar if it was like one character. Two of them now. We get Demon Armin. He looks like a Devil May Cry character. Oh 
Oh, that's what they're called. They're called the lanes. I see now why you declined my request to perform the ceremony. I... Demons have no place in our sacred rites. You're a priest who uses all of his gifts to help those in need. And you saved my life today with one of those gifts. What we are does not determine who we are. Tyrant. You will preside over my coronation. Consider it my first order as your king. Very well. Glad that's settled. Shall we? Nice. Your character is so goofy, I love her. I love her too! I love my, my sparkly Barney. I didn't actually realize you can play this game entirely in first person. Like, it probably makes the game look pretty difficult as well. If you can't really see where you're going. Oh, it's really difficult to control my character when it's zoomed in. Okay, coronation time. We will now begin the rites of coronation. Prince Thyrain, kneel before your ancestors. The prince shall now take the vow of kings. As king of Lutera, my enemies are only evil and injustice. I pledge my life to defend my people as their shield. Adventurer, bring forth the crown. Hello. Oh, wait, okay. I need to actually go get the crown. I forgot I wasn't carrying it. Let me swing my hips. And with this holy crown, I anoint thee as King Thyrain of Lutera. Noish. <laughs> the body walk in the body alpha. Your Majesty. <laughs> Three cheers! Long live King Thyrain! For the terror! For the terror! Your Highness, please! Oh, this doesn't look good. <laughs> Sir Bernard and his forces were ambushed by demons on his way here. Most of us were annihilated. The survivors are holding out at Medric Monastery. They can't hold out for long. Does she say that dungeon with the body of one? Now she's a den. Oh, I love that. Rest now. Your sacrifice shall not be in vain. Everyone. Two arms. She's ten boys of Barney outfit. Eleven. We march on Medric Monastery immediately. Yeah. Okay. From this moment on, our army will head to the Medric Monastery. The old man, I mean Sir Bernard, looked after me since I was a child. He fought for me even amid the tyrannical world of Sherat. Now he's in danger. We'd best hurry. Choose. Oh, no, I want to go now. Oh, wait. Hmm, what's going on? It just so happens I'm a Delane too. Wait, I'm I'm also apparently a Delane. Okay. Oh no, wait. Oh no, it's because of the class I picked. Yeah, I'm I'm also a Delane. I forgot. Okay. From your strength, I thought so. But you and Armin are grateful people. It doesn't matter. Please join us once you finish making your preparations at Lake Bar. 
Oh. Thyrain, playing king with his toy soldiers. Oh no, it's the hot demon. <laughs> how dare he oppose me? Considering how he's managed to assemble such a sizable force already, perhaps he is worthy of the crown after all. Bah! That he was worthy vanquisher would be a light. He's not worthy of ruling an outhouse, much less a kingdom. I'd kill him now if we didn't need him in order to find the Eagle Seal. Which, I believe, interests you far more than me. Ha. <laughs> but you need me. So what I want, you want. Uh, whatever. Those cowards in the West will never follow Thyrain. <laughs> Things are turning out to be quite interesting. I forgot the hot demon though does have a bit of a goofy walk. Right. Okay. I think that'll be a good place to stop. Thank you guys very much for watching the stream and I hope you had a wonderful time. I'll catch you guys next time. Good night everybody. Bye-bye.